and welcome to a new vlog good morning good morning i don't have any makeup on i have not been wearing makeup in these vlogs so i hope y'all haven't been like okay with the natural face okay <laughs> at least my hair done at least my hair kind of cute i had a hat on so it kind of flatten but as y'all can see i'm in my cloth is it's still not 100 percent done but it's getting there it's getting there i put up some hats i uh put up some pictures over here so it's getting there um well let me just start off by saying welcome welcome back to the people who have been following me but if you are new here welcome my name is jessica aka just beauty artistry on all socials make sure you guys are following me on instagram and tiktok and all that jazz um Today is a new vlog. We're starting this vlog off fresh. And it's actually going to be a pretty good vlog because I am going on a trip this weekend. Um, so I am in a sorority, Delta Sigma Theta. Ooh, hey, sororers, if you out there, if you following me. Um, so I'm going on a trip to see my sans, my sorority sisters, my line sisters. Um, this is like our 15th year. We are oh. 15 years baby <laughs> we old out here um we the old heads now <laughs> if you know you know okay but anyways um so yes we are going to have our kind of like reunion get together um we are going to tulsa um one of my sorority sisters lives there and so we haven't seen her um you know her neck of the woods yet we haven't been there yet so we decided to have it there this year they have some really cool things planned so i'm definitely gonna bring you guys with me um and then also in this vlog i'm going to try i don't know if i'm gonna be able to wrap up my closet in this vlog i have to be honest because Y'all know I don't have a tripod, so my arm getting tired. Let me put y'all down a little bit. Um, <laughs> I'm going to get that, though. I'm going to get it soon. Don't worry. It's been some other things I've had to deal with with the house that I've not been able to get my tripod. Not my tripod, but the piece for it. I'm going to get it, though. Um, But anyways, um, not going to be able to probably complete the closet, but I'm going to hang up a few more things. Like, let me show you. I have... <coughs> I have my elephant here that I'm going to hang up right over here in this like little corner right here. Um, and also want to do like a floating shelf here. So the elephant will be up top. And then I may do either two floating shelves, like maybe one here and then one up in that corner. So that way I can display my books. I have some books that I usually have um, over my desk. I'm also going to do some floating shelves over here so I can put more shoes up um and also i'm definitely going to do something on this look at oscar down there definitely going to do something on this wall um something high up of course i'm not sure what that's going to be yet but but yeah so the cloth fist is coming together y'all can see i'm working it's coming together <coughs> um this is going to go away this is actually a t-mobile wi-fi box <laughs> which i just got new wi-fi um, I have Verizon. If anybody has Verizon, anybody got Verizon, if it works well, let me know how it's been going for you. But T-Mobile, unfortunately, in this area doesn't work. It worked great when we lived <clears throat> in New York. But for some reason over here, the um, service is just not good over here. And I didn't want to give it up because it's connected to my cell phone bill. But... <clears throat> I had to give it up and we had to go with Verizon. So we knew to Verizon. I still got T-Mobile phone, um, cell phone though. Um, but I don't know. I may even make the switch to Verizon. What y'all think about Verizon? Y'all tell me, give me the deets. Um, mm, that coffee is so good. So I need to work. <laughs> so I'm going to put on some lo-fi beads and I am going to zone in on work because i have to pick up kingston in a few hours from school he's doing so good in his new school guys i just love it and he just loves his teachers it just melts my heart when he talks about his teachers he loves them and so when somebody taking good care of your babies you gotta appreciate them so i'm probably gonna get them something for christmas <laughs> i don't know what i'm gonna get them but i'm gonna get them something for christmas um 
so yeah i just want to jump on here i did order some things from just fab because i had like six credits y'all i never use my credits <laughs> with just fab when i forget to skip the month um uh, but i have like six credits and i went in and i used all six of them credits and literally i got six items which the original price would have been like over 200 dollars, like 270 dollars. guess how much i spent on it your girl spent 24 dollars, and i only spent 24 dollars because i wanted it to ship fast so that i can get my stuff before i leave on friday i don't know how likely it's gonna be <laughs> i'm hoping fingers crossed i'm praying that it will come tomorrow but if it don't get here tomorrow it'll get here on friday but i'll already be gone by then so i'm hoping that it comes um tomorrow at some point because there's at least one thing one or two things that i purchased that i would definitely would like to bring with me but if it doesn't come it's not the end of the world i'm probably gonna go to burlington later today and meet neil because we have like a couple holiday parties we're gonna go to and I have no clothes. Guys, I have no clothes. That's probably why I'm not even like super focused on like getting like my stuff in this closet. Cause it ain't nothing that it ain't nothing that hot right now. Ain't nothing popping up in this closet. Um, I got a few things that I'm gonna pack that it looks really nice. Um, but for like holiday wear, I don't know if I have anything. Cause we got some parties to go to. Which I can't wait, cause we need to. Me and my husband need to get out. Have a little drinky drink, dance a little bit, party a little bit. We didn't get to go to the last year's holiday party. And me and Neil work at the same job. If y'all follow me, you probably already know that. But if not, Neil and I work at the same job. And so we are going to the holiday party together. One of the parties I'm not going with him, um, he's going because he worked in this specific office. I never worked in that office. So he's going to go to that party. I don't know them folks like that but the big party for everyone we both will attend um and everybody knows us as like a married couple so it's not awkward at all it's fun um people love us as a couple and we be jamming kicking it with everybody so yeah I'm excited got a lot going on so we got some stuff happening this is gonna be a pretty good vlog y'all so keep watching okay okay make sure y'all hit that notification button so y'all know when i'm updating this here house that we have all right okay guys we got our blinds the first one is up isn't it so nice so here's the comparison <laughs> before after <laughs> so pretty so i'm gonna i'm about to put up the other two and I'll show you guys once I'm done. I have to turn this light off because Kingston is sleeping. He's tired. I'm so tired. <laughs> Kingston is knocked out, so. Alrighty, let's see the second one. But you know what? Alright, that's two. What? We got one more to go. The blinds. And your booty. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wait, I'm showing the street. Let me not show the street. I'm showing the street, girl. I don't want nobody to know where I live. They live in a cul-de-sac. Oh, look at the blinds. Ow. Look at the blinds. Okay, so I'm going to have the blinds on my LTK shop. Um, They are faux wood blinds. I got them off Amazon. I'm probably going to show you guys again in the morning because I know it's dark. But... These are what they look like. Neil was hoping that they actually look like white wood. Like have like the, what is it? Like the lines from like the wood. Wood, grain, wood, wood grain. grain, that's it. But they don't have wood grain on them. They're just like plain white. So if that's something that you're looking for, these are not the ones. <laughs> <laughs> these aren't, this ain't it. But yeah. They look so good. And then soon we'll get some drapes and we'll hang up our drapes. But again, we're painting down here. We haven't started yet. Uh, we had gotten the ceiling fixed here and that's why you see the paint like that. But let me not show y'all the street. But yeah, we, um, we still have to paint down here. Neil and I are debating if we're going to paint or if we're going to pay somebody to paint down here. We got this, kid. We got this? 
We got this. All right. He said we got this. I think the cloth is. Really and I got good. my wine. We got practice. <laughs> yes. Donde esta mi vino? Mm-hmm. All of it. Good morning, guys. Good morning, good morning, good morning. So the blinds are done. I'm going to show you guys. We did the blinds. Um, I have to work. But I wanted to jump on here really quickly so that I can show you guys the blinds. Um, I'm not sure when we're going to paint in here. We need to. We still haven't received our couch. The chairs that I showed you guys earlier are a flop. Um, they sent us new chairs and those were just as damaged. So it ain't look too good for this uh, furniture company. Um... I'm kind of nervous to even get the couch. <laughs> I'm like, what are y'all going to send me in this couch? And I was a third party, so it's technically not whoever was sent, whoever sent the couch, the chairs, they're not sending the couch. So I'm hoping that they take better care of the things in their warehouse than this company does because those chairs are horrible and I love them. They look they look really nice and they would have been perfect in this space, but I'm not paying for jacked up chairs. Like I'm not spending my money for chairs that I could have got from a thrift store. And if I needed to fix them up, I can go to a thrift store and fix up chairs. I bought brand new chairs. So I expect them to come in brand new condition. Like make it make sense. But I'm a little annoyed by that. They still haven't gotten back to me. I'm well, they got back to me. They just haven't told me when not to expect a refund, and they still haven't picked up these chairs, the second set. They've been sitting here. The delivery guy, I opened the package up in front of the delivery guy. I was like, wait, don't you go nowhere, because I want to make sure these are good before you leave. And I opened them up. He was right there, and they he saw that it was damaged. But he said he couldn't take it back. He, um, I would need to call the store, let them know, and then they will probably have him pick them up the next day. They have not had him pick them up. I've had these chairs probably for about a week now, and they have not picked up these chairs. So, super annoyed by that. But, again, I'm not in, like, no super rush right now because we do have to paint in here. We just had a few, like, fixer-upper type projects that we needed to do. Um, like I said, the ceiling, there was a window in the in the kitchen that we needed to fix. Not the window, but like the drywall underneath the window. And then also like a piece, the wood piece outside <clears throat> for the window seal. We had to fix that. So, um, y'all, me and this thing on not having a tripod is annoying. Um, so, we got a lot of stuff going on, but... We are still in our happy place. <laughs> um, we just been working with this futon because um, I threw away my couch. My couch was in very bad condition, our old couch. So I had to throw that out. I was using slip covers. It was bad. Um, and so we're just rocking with our little futon. Um, I got my nice rugs. I'll be sitting on the floor um, watching my TV. Um, so we got a lot of stuff going that's going to come pretty soon, but let me go ahead and just stop jabbing, jabbering and, um, show you guys the windows. All right, here they are. I got them cracked just a little bit, just to let a little sunshine in. Our house is like on a corner, so I don't want like to expose the entire living room right now. <laughs> Once we get our drapes and it's a little bit more closed in, then I'll probably be a little bit more comfortable with opening the, the blinds completely open. Um, but yeah, these are the blinds. They look so good. I'm gonna close them so y'all guys can see what they look like. Show y'all my street. but yeah these are the blinds guys they look so much better i like them i really do i'm actually not a fan of blinds and that's why i went with these because i'm like i don't want to get the regular normal type of blinds if we if we're going to have blinds i wanted something that was a little bit different now they have those blinds that you could just like these you could just lift them up it's this cordless 
which I love. But they also have like the really nice seamless blinds where they're not technically like this. And in order for you to see outside, you have to lift up the um lift the blinds i didn't want those because we live on a corner and i don't want again i don't want to expose our entire house um on this corner um so that's why i opted for these blinds and i'm actually pretty happy with them they look so good so so good so i'm happy can't wait till we paint because once we paint, they really going to pop. And then we'll have our nice chairs, two chairs here. We're going to have a big old plant with the pot. Ah, I'm going to have a nice little table, little table right in between the two chairs, right in this area. It's going to be so freaking cute. And then on this wall, and again, you guys know we're, we still got boxes and all kind of stuff here. But on this wall, I'm going to, we're probably going to do a build in. We're gonna do it ourselves. We're gonna really try and build, do a nice fireplace building. So it's gonna be a fireplace and we'll have our TV mounted on the top. Um, and then I'm gonna have like some type of bookshelves or something on the sides. So um, that way I just have, or floating shelves. I don't know if I'm gonna have floating shelves or bookshelves, but something. And then also I'll have like some type of uh, TV stand or something right underneath the fireplace. It'll be something like this, of course, but longer, um, like a TV stand where I can decorate. And so that's going to be, because this is like a really long wall. And so I have so much room to just kind of play around with this wall. So I'm so excited about doing that building. That's going to be coming. Whew, I'm so excited. Super excited. And then on this side... This is, of course, our futon right now, but we're going to have our couch actually on this side. And I have the futon pushed up because I'm actually going to have the couch pulled out like this. And then I'll have something, some type of like table back here with like, um, I don't know if it's going to be a picture or a mirror. Something is going to be over like right behind the couch. It'll be an L-shaped couch. So um, the couch will be like right here and then it'll come down towards the um, dining area. And then we're also gonna have chairs and everything for the island, which will be cute. And then um, in the dining room on this wall, I want to do like, I don't know if I wanna do like a black wall and then get one of those like um, oval shaped, what do you call them? Kind of like a china cabinet, but a display cabinet. It'll be like one of those oval shaped, but I want to have a black one. And then I may do like wall scouts. What are they called? Scouts? So, I don't know. Like wall um, lights on the side of it. And that'll be super cute right there, I think. And it'll be enough room because this, of course, won't be there. So it'll be enough room for you to be able to walk past. Oh, it's going to be so cute. I'm super excited about that. And then we'll have our our chairs and then I'm gonna have on this wall probably be like a mirror or a painting or something will be on that wall. So I'm excited about it guys. And yeah, so we got things happening over here. We got some things going, at least the little things for now. We're just kind of like taking our time, getting things piece by piece. Like I said, we had a few few uh hiccups a few things that we ran into that was more important and needed to be fixed as opposed to worrying about certain furniture pieces or decorating and painting um uh, my cloth office we took over that kingston's room's going to be next and down here we'll probably we may do it all simultaneously i don't know we'll see um uh, because we need to do kingston's room and we need to do down here my room and Neil's room will probably be the last thing that we do. I'd rather have Kings to be very comfortable and then our living space down here be co more comfortable. And then we'll worry about our bedroom later. So, yeah. All right, let me get off this chatterbox and start. <laughs>
live for the weekend. Yeah, I want coffee. I mess up the charcuterie. <laughs> this is so cute. Okay, I like this. This is really nice. I might need to do something like this with my bathroom. Let me get some decoration inspo. I love that. Hang on. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Oh, I just thought you had on me. Hey, we ready to go. Oh, look at that booty, go! <laughs> <laughs> it's a video. It's a video. Oh, put it on, put it on. Hey, get it, get it, get it, get it. <laughs> <clears throat> Come on, girls. Are you guys ready? <laughs> We are going to see Mike Epps. Yo, this is like a little happy little surprise we done yeah, did we, here. We, this is minute. such a good, a good backup plan. Good thing, yeah. Oh, never fails. <laughs> <laughs> never fails. All right. Whatever. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Andrea, where are we going? This place is called In the Raw. In, in, in the, the Raw. raw. Sushi. Oh, I'm gonna get some sushi. Yeah. Oh, sushi! Time and late. We should have. We should have. That's up my alley. We should have ate here. We were supposed to. Oh, oh. Yeah. We were supposed to. Let's go. <laughs> That's great. Oh, I like those chairs.
I know my place right here on Greenwood Avenue mm -hmm. doing good business mm -hmm. with good people like O.W., A.C. Jackson, and Dora Wells. See, we showed what we're about. Mm -hmm. This proved all that mess about Hey, guys. I have not been talking to you guys this entire trip that I have been in Tulsa <laughs> because we literally have been having such a great time. Um, I just haven't had the time to, like, pick up the camera to actually talk but um just wanted to hop in here just to say this is the last day that we're going to be here um my sorority sister is having a an event um and i'll put all her information in the description um but she has events called sunday steel you guys can follow her on social media um so that way you can kind of learn a little bit more about what sunday steel is you can also follow her she's amazing these events that she hosts in tulsa are the absolute best so definitely follow um my sorority sister and my boo boo <laughs> andrea um and take a look at her sunday steel content um but yeah so i'm gonna go back out there and i will show you more about the event i'll try to get some footage so that way you can guys you guys can see what the event is about um so yeah all right guys